Hi guys, welcome to Taramara Music. Uh, my name is Matt and we're here today with Aaron Fennick from Fennick Guitars. Aaron, welcome to Taramara Music. Thank you, thanks for having me. We've recently uh, come on board with Fennick as one of their dealers and we're super excited to have their guitars in store. Uh, they have some amazing tone woods, some really beautiful models uh, and they sound fantastic and they feel great too. Um, so Aaron, tell us a little bit about your story uh, and what makes uh, what makes Fennec Guitars so special. Okay, well I've been sort of making guitars for around about 15 years. Sort of officially launched Fennec Guitars in 2016. More as a boutique builder, so building, you know, really sort of one-off special custom guitars for people. Brazilian rosewood and, you know, really rare and sort of timbers. Um, and then sort of, you know, being a gigging musician myself, thought, well, it'd be really nice to produce a range of boutique made, um, Australian made guitars and get them into stores. So we sort of come up with the range that you see um, behind you today, more, I suppose, in the more affordable end. Um, and we've been doing that. We officially launched into stores and dealers uh, just as the pandemic hit, which was very interesting. Um, but the success has been amazing. So we've, um, uh, now pushed out across all of Australia in different states. Talk us through some of the models, um, yeah. some of the woods that you use and, and how does the sort of range progress? Yeah, so we basically have what's called a standard range and then a select range. So our standard range starts off with the VT series. A lot of people ask me what the VT stands for. <laughs> um, it's really, that's a whole other side story, but basically when, we, when I sort of started making the range, everybody just kept commenting on the volume and the tone. So we thought, well, it was a pretty apt way to, to describe the series. So we start with um, the, the VT series, and it's our entry level. So we use timbers like camphor laurel back and sides, uh, Australian blackwood, New Guinea rosewood, which most people may not have heard of before in an instrument, um, but it's got a beautiful tone. Mm -hmm. Then we jump up to our hardwood series, which is called a VTH, so H for hardwood. And this is a new one for us. So we do an all mahogany, so it's genuine mahogany. Um, and we also do Australian blackwood and New Guinea rosewood as well in that series. Then we things start to get really, really serious and we jump to the what we call our professional series. And at this stage, you're getting Australian mother of pearl block inlays, lots of little different sort of purfling detail work. Uh, all of our guitars feature all wood bindings, um, which I think is really important for the quality. Um, you know, it's sort of you know, end wedges and just lots of boutique appointments that you would typically see on much higher priced guitars. Um, and then we get into now our select range, which is this guy here, which is a gloss mahogany um, back and sides, spruce top, satin necks. And then this mm. new guy right here, which is our new D75 dreadnought shape. And that's our vintage series, which is um, just beautiful. So shorter scale, 24 and three quarter scale, um, all come tobacco burst, herringbone details. So more of that Americana mm. sort of vibe. Final question. If someone out there is considering um, buying themselves a really nice guitar, um, why should they come in and, and see us and try out uh, one of one of the Fennec guitars we've got here. Yeah, look, I think we, we're probably offering something that's a little bit new in Australia. So a lot of my designs are probably akin to more of an American style sort of designed guitar. And what I mean by that is that the designs, the shapes, they're all unique. So we've basically designed these guitars from the ground up. So our dreadnoughts are different body depths than, than others on the market. They're a little bit more comfortable to play. Um, all, everything in here is just, there's a reason for everything, all the cuts in the waist and the cutaway positions. Um, we've got what I would consider much, much higher quality woods. So whereas most sort of larger production style guitar companies are probably considering saving costs on woods, um, we're going the other way. We're trying to figure out how much we can actually squeeze into these guitars. Um, so. Guitar's got to look good, it's got to sound good, and it's got to play good. And they're the three, they sound really basic, but they're the three things that we really focus on. And so I think people would be quite surprised when they come in and actually play them. Um, and let people decide, I suppose. I'm a guitar player and I want a guitar to hit me in the heart. Um, and I recommend that if people find them, they should jump on them, yeah. So come and give one a try. Awesome. So Aaron, thank you so much for coming down to visit and thanks for taking us through the range today. Um, great to see you. 
and yeah, come and try out some of these great guitars for yourself and yeah, find out uh, why we love them so much here.